What do you call a book club that's been stuck on the same book for years? Church. Did you hear about the breakfast cereal shaped like a famous detective novel series? They're called Agatha Krispies. I'm reading a book about anti-gravity. It's impossible to put down. I once swallowed a book of synonyms. It's gave me the sorest throat I've ever had. I'm writing a horror book in Braille. Something bad is going to happen. I can feel it. The book I ordered about clocks finally came in. It's about time. I've just finished writing a book on snakes. It would have been much easier if I'd just written it on paper. I wrote a book on how to fall down the stairs. It's a step-by-step -step guide. I got the book Internet Forums for Dummies from a friend. But I need to take it back, because I already read it. My wife dumped me due to my obsession with comic books. She said I have too many issues. I'm writing a book on reverse psychology. Please don't buy it. The laughter isn't over. We'll be back after this brief break. We started a band and called it Books. So no one can judge us by our covers. A book just fell on my head. I've only got my shelf to blame. I found the first four Harry Potter books to be quite lighthearted. The fifth one was dead serious. I read a book about World War II that was only four pages long. It was a bridge too far. After watching me read War and Peace, my son asked me, Dad, why is the book so thick? Well, it's a long story. My wife said, why don't you write a book instead of your stupid wordplay jokes? I said, that's a novel idea. I heard Optimus Prime is writing a book. It's an autobiography. What is a blind person's least favorite book? A cheese grater. I went to the library looking for a book about Pavlov's dog and Schrodinger's cat. The librarian said it rang a bell but she wasn't sure if it was there or not. Tablets were replaced by scrolls, scrolls were replaced by books. Now we scroll through books on tablets. I'm writing a book on hurricanes. It's only a draft so far. I fell off a book once. It's a long story. I went into the local library and asked if they had any books on the Titanic. Oh yes, quite a few. The librarian said. Sorry to hear that, I said laughing. They'll all be ruined by now. I recently launched a series of books targeted at young adults. Six of them are in hospital now, with three in intensive care. I used to read comic books, but I stopped. They're far too graphic. Probably one of the deepest books you will ever read. 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. I was offered a job assembling printed pages into books. A week later they tried to rescind the offer. I told them it was a binding agreement. I asked the librarian where books about oil were located. She said try the non-friction section. I ordered a book on puns. I didn't get it. Books about gardening are getting old. They've really grown on me. Did you know Jar Jar Binks has a brother who is a famous author? George Orwell. Did you hear about the author who used a period after every word? He got sentenced to death. What was the author missing for his next great book? A novel idea. Did you know that the author Joe Hill is Stephen King's son? He was worried no one would take him seriously when he was Joe King. What is a citrus's favorite author? Lemony Snicket. Authors never laugh at my jokes. They take everything literary. Why would an earthworm be a horrible author? Because of the sheer amount of plot holes he makes. What does the talkative, schizophrenic author say? Now we're Tolkien. Why do dogs make terrible authors? They can never make it past the rough draft. Did you hear about the author who died in a mountaineering accident before he could finish his book? They say his name was Cliffhanger. Hear about the author in jail? They put him in the writer's block. Couldn't get past his first sentence. What is the name of the author who writes children's books about mythology? Dr. Zeus. What would you call Harry Potter's author if she got shot in the back of her head? JFK Rowling. Just finished a beautiful novel in Braille. Such a touching story. Did you hear about the guy who wrote a novel based on prisoners he met in jail? 
it had its pros and cons. I accidentally put cornstarch in my novel. The plot thickened. I won first prize for my novel called Wasting Away. I got a trophy. I tried writing a novel about the Big Bang. The epilogue is taking forever to finish. I finished writing about half of my novel. It's for the semi-literate market. I wrote a novel about all the skeletons in the graveyard coming to life on Halloween. At least, that's the bare bones of it. Only one of Dickens' novel. Has a twist in the end. I read a novel about donuts. The story had a lot of holes. Why was the draft manuscript of a crime novel afraid of being completed? It did not want to be booked. Did they make a novelization of the room? Because everyone keeps telling me to read it. What kind of dinosaur writes romance novels? A brontosaurus. While getting dressed I noticed my wife had cut off the bottom of the leg hem from my jeans and was using it to save the pages of her novels. That was a turn up for the books. What do you get when you mix alcohol and literature? Tequila Mockingbird. I like my pasta like I like my medieval Italian literature. All Dante. Years ago, I had a job translating pre-classical Greek literature into Braille. It feels like ancient history. I saw my kid reading Fahrenheit 451. I asked him, how do you like it? He said, this book is lit. I just got a new job at a prison library. It has its pros and cons. Why couldn't the couple get married at the library? Because it was all booked up. I went to the library and asked for the self-help section. They said if they told me it would defeat the purpose. Why is the library the tallest building in town? It has the most stories. What kind of dogs are allowed in the library? Hush puppies. What does the ROM do at a library? It reads only memories. A man was arrested for robbing a library. They threw the book at him. My dad was a boxer that trained at the library. He really hit the books. While browsing the bookshop, I stuck a sheet of A4 paper to my wife's spine. She said she wanted a paperback for her birthday. I'm Bob Jeffy. And I'm Montgomery Jones. And that's the story Dad Jokes for National Book Day. We're on a mission to spread the laughs and groans far and wide, so please do us a favor and share just one of these jokes with your family and friends today. Thanks. Looking for more dad joke humor to share? Then subscribe to our new weekly email newsletter. It's our weekly roundup of the best dad jokes, memes, and humor for you to enjoy. Spread the laughs and groans and sign up today. Check the sign up link in the show notes page or visit dailydadjokespodcast.com. The Daily Dad Jokes Podcast is produced by Classic Studios. See the show notes page for social media links and joke credits. This show was recorded in front of a canned studio audience.